It's likely most adults haven't read a thousand books in their entire lives, but a program is working to make sure young children have read at least that many by the time they reach kindergarten. It challenges families to read with their children uh, a thousand books before they, they enter kindergarten in hopes of preparing them um, for the reading they're going to be doing when they enter school. The 1,000 Books Before Kindergarten program was launched here through the St. Joseph County Public Library. We are very big on early literacy, and um, I think this plays right in with early literacy, the 1,000 Books Before Kindergarten. One of the components is read, and we're always encouraging kids to read. The number of books really stood out to me, and I wanted to find out where the benchmark of 1,000 books came from. I believe the book um, by Mim Fox kind of just had a quote in it that said something like, wouldn't it be great if all kids read a thousand books before they, uh, they enter kindergarten? So it's not really a magic number, a thousand books. It's just a nice round number that's um, easy for our parents to remember. It kind of sticks in your head. But before parents start looking for that next grade read for their children, they need to sign up first. You can sign up at any uh, St. Joseph County Public Library location and when you uh, sign up you'll be given an information packet that will kind of explain the program and the librarians kind of walk you through the process and, and how it works and also kind of tell you other great things that we have at the library that can kind of also help with those early literacy skills. Um, for parents who don't have time to come to the library you can also sign up online. The biggest thing I like to tell them about this program is how easy it is for them to do it. That all they have to do is sign up and they get a piece of paper and the kids stamp it. It's so simple for them to do. And then we'll take care of the rest. That's all they have to do. And the program already has quite a few families getting started. Um, I am a teacher, uh, so I just think reading is really important and to develop that love of reading and of learning is just something that can be done by reading books. Before you start thinking reading a thousand books is going to cost an arm and a leg to achieve, no need to worry. The program is free and some make sure to take advantage of their local libraries. We get a huge stack of library books every week from the library and we just read through them and I kind of keep track by using a bingo dauber on our, on our little chart here. And yeah, we have a lot of fun and we celebrate each book that we read. And those who work at the local library branches are always looking for the best ways to make those visits fun and entertaining. Well, I'm hoping that I create a fun atmosphere, a welcoming atmosphere, um, an experience here for them so that they'll want to go in the library. I'm encouraging them to read as much as they want. Just when they come in the door, they feel welcome and it's a great experience. So they just head right into the library and it's all one big experience here. Like any program geared towards getting kids to read, a thousand books does have long-term goals. One of our um, missions here at the library is early literacy, and that's not teaching kids how to read, it's getting them ready so when they get to kindergarten, they have all the building blocks, they're ready to learn how to read. And this thousand books plays right into that, just reading as much as you can and getting the kids ready for kindergarten. Parents um, are the child's first teacher, and when a child reads to their, a uh, parent reads to their child, that child associates those, you know, good positive feelings of reading um, with books. And so they kind of grow up loving books. There's um, a greater chance that, that when they get big, uh, older, that they will continue that love of reading. I think this is a great program to be intentional about reading and um, kids love it. And it's important for parents to sit down with their kids and read to inspire learning and um, good reading, future reading skills. But to add a little more fun to taking part, there are some short-term prizes the kids can earn. When they reach a uh, hundred books, they get a book buck, which will allow them to shop at our library book sale. Um, each library location also has a small sale shelf or cart where they sell books there. Uh, when they reach 100 books, they get a free tote bag. And when they reach a thousand books, they get a crown that they get to wear uh, for their achievements. But wait, there's more. When they reach every 100 books, they get recognized by library staff. They get to ring a special gong and get a sticker where they get to put on their uh, reading log sheet and just basically kind of uh, staff celebrates their achievements. They may get to do some fun things, but are the kids who take part enjoying all the books they're reading? It's a great way to be intentional about reading and my son loves it. He, he is very excited about his chart and um, showing and it's a great way to show how many books we we've read and keep track of those so he, he's very proud of all the books he's read. A thousand books before kindergarten. The benefits are there but it still seems like a tough mountain to climb but as many will tell you it can be done. 
a thousand does sound like a lot, but when you think if you start when a child is born, a newborn, all the way till they reach kindergarten, that's definitely an achievable goal. Oh, I know. Let's reach our to the scouts.